Hi guys, um, today I'm going to go ahead and show you how I did this look. Um, it's definitely a lot of teals and blues. It's really simple, it only took me a couple minutes, so I figured I'd show a quick tutorial on it. Um, definitely a good, I need to go out but don't want to spend a long time on my makeup. Um, good for last minute phone calls of going out to go do something, um, which is kind of why I'm doing mine. Okay, so to start off, I've already primed my eye um, using Urban Decay's Primer Potion. So we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm using mostly Urban Decay products today. Um, so let me show you what I'm working out of. Um, I've had this palette for a really long time. It's definitely a really fun palette. There's a lot of colors. I'm kind of missing a lot because I overused them a little bit. Um, but today I'm starting with a little bit of this color here which is called Grifter. It's a really nice light sparkly lavender color. And I'm going to go ahead and just put that on the very inner corner. And this color is going to be a little bit hard to see on camera, so I will take some still shots so that you can see um, exactly what it looks like. But basically, starting with a really light color here in the corner is going to kind of give it a softer look um, in that inner corner. I rarely will wear a dark color on my inner corner. I just don't like that look on me particularly. So you'll usually see me start with a lighter color there. Okay, and then next I'm going to go ahead and do Shattered here, which is this nice, really pretty teal. And I'm going to put that over pretty much the rest of my whole lid. I'm leaving just a tiny little bit of space over for the dark blue that we're going to use, but it's almost all going to be shattered for the rest of my eyelid. Okay, and then I'm just going to blend that, and you're going to want to blend this really, really good. Um, the dark blue, you don't need to blend into the teal as much. You're mostly wanting to make sure that it doesn't look like you have this light purple, then a super thick line of just teal from then on. Because it's such a light color, you're going to really need to work on your blending here. And that'll probably be what takes the longest for this whole look. is just making sure that that's really well blended. Okay, so for the dark color, I'm using um, L'Oreal's High Intensity Pigments in a little duo here. Um, the duo name is Showy. Um, I borrowed this from my sister. Thanks. Um, so basically you're just going to take this dark color and put it into your crease and then that tiny little bit of space that we left over. Like I said, this is just a really simple, fast look. Okay, so you're going to get that nice and really blended well into your crease. want to double check and make sure that everything's kind of even there. My eyes always tend to turn out slightly uneven. Um, I think my eyes might be a little crooked. Okay, and then for the last thing that I did before I lined my eyes and everything was my highlight color. And I'm using... Asphyxia from Urban Decay. It's a really nice, pretty, like, sheer and iridescent lavender color. I don't know how well you can see that on my skin. Um, but it definitely makes a really pretty highlight if you're using, like, a lighter purple in your look. Um, because it kind of just makes everything pop a little bit. This is also a really cool color to put over something and see how it turns out. It kind of transforms eyeshadow colors a little bit. Um, I've used this with like black and putting this over it kind of turns it into a nice 
like blue um, and it just it really does a lot of different things I really love this color so I'm just gonna put that into my brow bone area and blend that down and then I'm just gonna go ahead and touch up a little bit more of the blue to kind of even my eyes out a little bit okay now I'm gonna go ahead and line my eyes really quick and I'm using um, the Alme liquid liner in black and then I'm going to put on my mascara and I'm using Maybelline's The Falsies um, and that's about all that there is to the lining part I'll come back in a minute and show you um, how everything looks finished okay so that's it like I said very simple very easy and quick um, I just lined my eyes um, and put on a lip stain by Maybelline. It is their color Sensational and this color is number 35. Um, and then I just put on a clear lip gloss. Not really a brand to it, it's just something that I've had forever. Um, and yeah, that's really it. So please go ahead and subscribe. Next week I'm going to start doing um, my first theme week. I'm looking forward to it so much. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet, um, but it's definitely going to be fun and hopefully give you guys some fun ideas for Halloween because um, they're definitely going to be a lot of really fun and wild looks. So stay tuned and look for that and um, I'll see you later.